zero wala translate insyaallah we we'll start our class now can teacher have a uh, yazikra reciting doa today do you remember doa before we start our class aria zikri yes okay, everyone raise up your hand Zikri, turn on the microphone. Allahumma fa'alaina. Allahumma fa'alaina. It's okay, follow the teacher, my dear. It's okay, follow the teacher. Allahumma fa'alaina. Allahumma <laughs> Rubbish Rahli, Rubbish Rahli, Sadari, Sadari, Yasili, Yasili, Omri, Wahlul Oh Data, Wahlul, Wahlul Oh Data, Milisani, Milisani. Ya kohu kauli. Ya ya kohu kauli. Kami alamin. Thank you, Zikri. Well done. Okay, everyone. Uh, so before we uh start, before teacher show you the slide, okay, let's watch a video together first about what we are going to learn today. Okay, before this, we have done about topic animals right so inshallah today we are going to start with topic plants all right so the children can you show teacher thumbs up if you can see my screen yes you can see now i cannot see the screen i cannot can I see, see the too now, can you see the YouTube page? Can I not? Yes, now I can see. Yes, now yes, I can okay. see. Yes, okay. Alright, Alhamdulillah. Okay, so uh, let's uh, look at the video. Let's hear what Dr. Bynox okay. wants to share with you first. Yes, come again, my dear. All right. Ah, so just now we have seen a video of Doctor Binox. Ah, okay, Ishira, Ishira, can Ishira turn on the microphone? Ishira. Ishira, can you turn on the microphone? Your microphone is working or not? Ishira. Okay, Hafia, Hafia Medina, can you turn on the microphone, Hafia Medina? <laughs> okay, Hafia Medina, Dr. Vainok is talking about what just now? We were watching the video about what just now? I can't see you. Yeah? Oh, so you you haven't watched the video that they just shared with you just now? No, okay. It's okay, so Medina, you can turn off the microphone. All right. Can teacher have Fatima? Fatima, can you turn on the microphone? Yes, teacher. Okay, Dr. Vinox, just now the video that we watched. Uh, what did Dr. Vinox share with us just now, Fatima? 
About what? The video is about what? About plant. About plant. Good job. Thank you, Fatima. Okay, so just now we have watched a video about plants. All right. Uh, why plants is very important for us, for human, for this world that we are living in. Why they are important? Because uh, plants will absorb, they will take the carbon dioxide. We human, when we breathing, we breathe, when we breathe in, we will take oxygen. We breathe in. Can everyone breathe in together with teacher? Uh, teacher will count. Let's breathe in together. One, two, three. Let's breathe in. Uh, try to breathe in. Okay. Hold your breath and breathe out. Ah, so when we breathe in just now, the oxygen will come inside. Ah, uh, oxygen will come inside our nose. Uh, okay. Then when we breathe out, breathe out, we release. Okay, carbon dioxide. All right. So the plants they will uh, give us oxygen and they will take the carbon dioxide from us. Ah, right. So this is why plants are very important for us humans, for animals and also for this world. Ah. If we didn't have plants in this world, who are going to give us oxygen? All right. Okay. So can teacher have Raisha? Raisha, can Raisha turn on the microphone? Yes. Yes, okay, Raisha. Can Raisha... Assalamualaikum, teacher. Okay, Raisha. Teacher, I haven't, teacher, I haven't had breakfast yet, so I have to have breakfast in class. Ah, okay, no problem. It's okay. Uh, uh, you can have your breakfast, but be careful. Do not spill uh, all over your book and also your phone, iPad, or laptop, okay? Uh, all right, so Raisha... Uh, this one, teacher have two plants here. The picture of two plants. This one, the first one is hibiscus. Uh, this one is hibiscus plant. This one is a low vera, low vera plant. Can Raisha tell teacher what is the different thing between these two plants? Uh, what is the difference that you can see? Okay, I see. Raisha, it's okay. You can tell teacher. What can you see from the picture? Okay. No flower. Okay, the other one don't have flower. Good job. Well done, Raisha. Thank you. Okay. Ah, so between these two plants, okay, we can see, we can observe that uh, the hibiscus plant have a flower, but the aloe vera plant didn't have the flowers. So that is the differences between these two plants. All right. So inshallah today, we are going to learn about parts of plants. Okay. Ah, same like human. Ah, same like human. We have our nose. We have our eyes. We have our ears. We have our air hand. Okay. So, all of our body parts have their own function. They have the work for them to do. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created, okay, all part of our body have their own function. Ah, so, same goes to the, uh, the plants, okay? Ah, so, the first part of the plant we have here is the flower. Ah, the pink one here is the flower, okay? Second one, we have stem. Ah, this one, the green uh, part here, we call it as stem. Okay, next one, the part of plant, we have leaf. Ah, we have the leaf, okay. And then the last one, we have root. Okay, so uh, we have four parts of plant that we are learning today. Okay, the first one is flower. Okay, flower. Second one, Stem, okay, stem here. Then the third one, leaf, all right, leaf. Then uh, last one is the root, ah, root over here. Sometimes, okay, the root of the plant is inside the soil. 
is inside the soil so that they can hold the plants together or ah we have learned before this okay the function of root uh, they can help plant to get the water right uh, plant uh, the the plant's root is inside the soil so they will help the plant to get the water from the soil uh, same like us human we need water to live as well right so plants they need water to stay healthy as well okay so later we are going to sketch the plant and also label their body part right but before that uh, we will go to this one first characteristic of different part of plant all right so just now, teacher already mentioned that plant have different part. Uh, what is the part that they have? They have flower, they have stem, they have leaf, and also root. Uh, for today, you just need to remember four, okay? Flower, stem, leaf, and root. That is the part of the plant, okay? So, every plant consists of different parts. Ah, same like us humans, we have hand, we have feet, we have ears, okay? Ah, that have their own function. So, for the flower, ah, just now teacher asked Raisha to differentiate between two plants, the hibiscus and also the aloe vera, okay? So, Ah, Raja said, okay, one uh, one plant, the hibiscus one, have a flower and another one didn't have the flower. Okay, so let's go to that one. Okay, for the flower, okay, in this world, we have a flowering plant and also non-flowering plant. Okay, this one is the lotus plant. If you want to see the real picture of this plant, you can open your textbook. Ah, uh, page 53. Ah, uh, page 53. Textbook, the green book, page. Color. Ah, uh, yes. Color. Page 53. Textbook, page 53. Teacher already prepared a picture here, but if you want to see a real picture, okay, real picture of the lotus flag, open, open page 53. Uh, Okay, who turn on the microphone? Do you have anything to ask, teacher? Yes, teacher. Yes? Facebook is the green one. The green one. Yeah, the green one. Page 53. 53. If you want to see the real picture of the lotus plant, you can uh, look at page 53 in your textbook. Okay? Uh, in your textbook. Okay. Uh, so we have lotus plant. Lotus plant is flowering plant. Flowering plant is the plant that have flower. We can see the flower. Okay. Uh, and the second one we have non-flowering plant. What is non-flowering plant? Uh, they didn't have any flower. Okay. They didn't have any flower with them. When we see the Yes. Come again. Okay, everyone, please check your microphone. Kylie, turn on your microphone. Okay, Kylie, turn off your microphone if you don't have anything to ask, teacher. Okay. Please follow the class rules so that you and your friend can hear my voice clearly. Thank you, everyone. Okay. So, ah, for the flower, okay, we have two types of plant. We have the first one, flower. Uh, yes. B53. Yeah. If yeah, you are this one. Huh? This one. Page 53 that have yeah, book. lotus plant. Uh, textbook, the green book. Textbook, textbook, the green one. Teacher, page what? 53, 5 and 3. 53. Teacher, teacher, this one, teacher. The green one, the green one. 
Did you like chat? Yes, correct. 53, 53. 53, 53. Okay. 53, teacher. Which one? Okay, uh, it's okay. If you couldn't find the book yet, okay. Uh, teacher already prepared a slide. It's just that if you want to see a real picture of the lotus plant, you can look inside your textbook. Okay, as for now, you can look at the screen first. Look at your screen first. Listen to teacher first. Okay, it's okay. If you want to check how the lotus plant looks like in real life, uh, later you can check inside your textbook. Okay, all right. So, second one, second one we have. Stem. Ah, just now we are looking at the flower, but now we have a stem. Okay, so for stem, we have two types as well. Uh, two types as well. The first one is woody stem. This one, this one is the durian tree. Okay, durian tree have woody stem. Woody stem. If the woody stem, it they are usually very hard and okay, uh, the texture is very hard, and you cannot simply break them. You cannot simply break that because it, they are very hard. Okay, woody stem. Second one, we have non woody stem. Uh, if a non woody, right, the texture usually very soft. Okay, you can break them. Uh, it's easier for you to break them. So remember, woody stem. Okay, their stem is very hard. Okay, hard. All right, non woody stem. Their texture is very soft ah so you need to remember woody stem you cannot simply break them using your own hand okay but non woody you can break them because the texture is soft right so it's easier to break them ah. but remember you cannot simply go to a plant then break their stem ah, you cannot do that to a plant okay ah all right, next one. We're going to look at the type of leaf. Ah, type of leaf, we have two types. As Teacher, well. outside my house, I got two um, rambutan tree in front. Is At my front yard is uh -huh. the yellow rambutan tree and behind is the red one. But, oh, uh, but both, yeah, okay. but both of the rambutan tree, their roots are too strong. I couldn't even break them. Yes, because that is the function of the root. They need to uh, hold the tree together. So when the uh, wind comes, okay, your rambutan tree can stay at this place. Ah, it will not be taken by the wind. So, uh, Safia, uh, can you tell teacher, your rambutan tree have woody stem or non-woody stem? Which one? It is woody stem. Woody stem, good It's job. very hard. It's very hard. Ah, well done. Thank it's you. very hard to break. Yes, it's very hard to break. Well done, Safia. Thank you for sharing. Ah, okay. So, Safia already shared with us just now about her rambutan tree. Okay, so uh, the rambutan tree have woody stem as well. Okay, woody stem. They are hard. Okay, the stem is very hard uh, and you cannot simply break with them. Okay. All right, so next one, we're going to look at the type of leaf. Ah, type of leaf, we have two as well. It's okay. Um, later, we will uh, do the activity in our Tatan book. Okay, if you see that, uh, which one teacher Diha told, told me just now, I don't remember. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay, later, we will go one by one. Teacher, help, uh, teacher will help you to do the um picture and also the labeling in your tatan book we're going to do together okay don't worry okay so for the type of leaf we have two as well two type of leaf the first one okay <clears throat> the first one is method veins okay like this rose plant all right the leaf vein have naked uh veins uh, later teacher will show you how netted veins looks like and and at the other one, we have parallel vein. Uh, later, this will show you as well how parallel veins look like. Don't worry. 
okay? It's just that you need to know the type of leaf vein we have to. The first one is method vein. Second one, we have parallel vein. All right. Next one, ah, type of root. Just now, we have seen inside the Dr. Bynot's video about type of root. So, we have two types of root. The first one is tap root. Ah, this rose plant has tap root. And uh, the, uh, this one, uh, we call it as pendanus. Uh, pendanus. In Malay, some people call it as uh, down pandan, uh, right? Uh, in fact, we call it as pandanus plant. Uh, what is the function of uh, I ask down pandan. Where? In your yard as well? No, behind, at the front yard. At the front yard. I also have down pandan, smell nice. Yes, it smell nice. Good job, down pandan. You also. Yeah, usually people uh, people will use it in cooking uh, because they smell nice. Uh, for example, yes, correct. I, uh, I um use I pick um down pandan using making a uh, kue. Making kue, yes, correct. People use down pandan. Okay, the pandanus. Uh, in uh in science or in English, we call it as pandanus. Pendanus plant, okay. People use it in cooking so that it can help uh, for the food to smell nice. Uh, for easiest example for us to get is nasi lemak. Okay, people use uh, pendanus uh, plant in nasi lemak. Alright. Okay, so can all I of use the own pandan for making onde onde? Onde onde, yes, correct. Down pandan to make onde onde. For the smell or uh, you use it for the smell or for the color? For, for, the, the, for the color and smell. For the color and smell. Good job. Yeah. Okay. Yes? Who called teacher just now? Yes, yes? My mother uh -huh. use mm -hmm. dough pandan. Okay. To what? Black green. What? What? Fragrant. Fragrant? Yes. Yes. Ah, okay. Because uh, the pandanus plant, they smell very nice. Ah, so pe some people use that in cooking. Ah, okay. Ah, so teacher, hope uh, all of you know what is pandanus plant. Ah, in Malay, we call it as down pandan. Okay. Down pandan. Ah. But in science, in English, we call it as pandanus plant. Okay, so everyone open your tatan book. Okay, we're going to draw and label a hibiscus plant. Everyone open your tatan book now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, already open. Yes. Yes, okay. Can I see? Okay, okay, wait. I stop presenting for a while. Let the teacher oh, yeah. go through again. Don't worry. Teacher wanna see who already take your tatan book. Okay, uh, okay, Afia, take out your tatan book. Um, okay, we are going to draw together parts of plant. Okay, we're going to draw parts of plant together. Alright, so today you need to know uh, four important part of land that teacher shared with you just now. Alright, everyone already take out your tatan book. I'm going to share the screen with you again. Everyone already have your tatan book? Yes. yes. Okay, good job everyone. Who didn't have your tatan book? Can you tell teacher if you didn't have any tatan book with you? Teacher hope you are teacher hope you are using I your Zikri have have or not Zikri? Have. have okay good job. Teacher hope everyone is using your science tatan book okay. Please use the same book for science class okay. Um before this in 
physical class at school all of you already have your tatan book so every time we have science online class please use the same book okay all right so teacher will share with you the screen again so that we can draw together all right prepare your pencil color pencil with you okay wait teacher will share the screen we're going to write day and date first as usual. All right, can you show teacher thumbs up if you can see my screen? Show teacher thumbs up. You can see. All right, good job. Thank you. Let's write the day for today. What day is today, everyone? Monday. Monday. Good job. How to spell Monday? M O M O N. Well done. Thank you. Monday. M O N D A Y. You can write inside so your teacher, Yes. You need color pencil for to color the plant. Yes, correct. Now you're going to draw, label, then color. Okay. All right. We already wrote the day. How about date? Ah, date. So we write the date. Okay, today is 14th June already. Okay, you can write the date inside your tatan book. All right. So for the day, you can write uh, on the top corner. Okay, top corner of your left side okay inside your tatan book for the date you can write on the top corner of right side inside your book okay day and date so as usual every time we want to do the activity we uh, have to can I shut my pencil? yes you may shut your pencil okay okay so um as usual Okay, uh, after writing day and date, okay, we are going to write the title, the title. Okay, so Yusuf, Yusuf is here or not, Yusuf? So, Yusuf not here today. Okay, so the title, okay, the title that we are learning about, what we're learning about today in class, okay, we're learning about plan. Uh, this one, title. Teacher, we draw down or up? This one, this one. This one title. Title you write uh, at the top. Top of your tatan book. Done. Done. All right, everyone is done writing the title? No. Not yet. Ah, okay. Teacher will give you two more minutes, okay, to write the title. P-L-A-N-T. Plan. Okay, write the title. Okay. So, we are going to draw a hibiscus, okay? Hibiscus plant. Ah, don't worry. Let's do together with teacher. Okay. Ah, let's do together with teacher. How the hibiscus looks like. All right. So the first one we are going to start with drawing the flowers of hibiscus. How the hibiscus flowers look like. Okay. You can draw like this. Draw the petal first. Okay, first petal. 
Then continue with the second one like this. The third one like this. The fourth one. Then the fifth one. Okay. Ah, this one the hibiscus flower. But the hibiscus they have enter ah enter so you can draw like this okay small circle here for the enter okay you can take your time to draw it's okay don't worry yes you wanna you wanna draw a white hibiscus mm -hmm. Okay, you may do so. No problem. Hi, Whiskers. Done. Okay, good job. Hi, Whiskers. You can choose later. Either you want to color your Hi, Whiskers flower with red, or you can, uh, if you want to uh, use white color pencil, or if you don't want to color them, you can take your Hi, Whiskers as white Hi, Whiskers. You may do so. Okay. Hibiscus, we have white hibiscus as well, all right? We have white, we have yellow, we have uh, red. Yes. Ah, so you can choose, all right? All right, ah, so we already draw the petals, the flower, and also the anther, all right? We're going to draw first. The first one, we're going to draw all of them first, the stem, the leaf. The letter we label. After we label, we give name of all the plants part. Then later we color. Color is the last one. Okay, color is the last one. We draw, we label, then we color. Color is the last one. Ah. Okay, let's continue. We're going to draw the stem. Ah, the stem. Okay, draw the stem. Okay, ah, there you go, the stem. Then teacher will add the leaf. Okay, just now we have seen about a leaf vein, right? Vein, what is vein? Ah, if you uh, can observe a leaf, okay, they usually have a line like this. So, this is what we call leaf vein. Uh, line on the leaf. Uh, on the leaf. Okay, your drawing, if it doesn't look like mine, it's okay, all right? You can draw your own version of hibiscus plant as long as you have all the important part of the plant. You have the flower, you have the anther here, you have the leaf, you have the stem here. Ah. Okay, you can draw first. Yes. How to draw a leaf? How to draw? No, no. You want to? You want to write? Okay, okay. Okay, teacher, we write. For now, please, have you done drawing all? Ah, you draw first, draw first, draw first, then label. So, this one is the root. Root is usually inside the soil, okay? Ah, this one is the soil. So, the root usually inside the soil, okay? Why the plant have the root? So that it can absorb water, it absorb water from the soil. And also, it can help the plant to stay strong, okay? To stand strong. Even when there's strong wind, car, right? 
So, next one, uh, teacher will label, okay? One, uh, teacher will label one by one, okay? It's okay, don't worry. Ya Allah, Ya Rabbi. Okay, this one. And so. Grass, you want to draw a grass? Ah, okay, as long as you're done with your um, hibiscus plan, you can add uh, grass to your drawing. If you guys have any problem, you can tell teacher, okay? I'll try my best to help you. Okay, please make sure you label all the plants part, right? Okay. If you're done later, you can update teacher in the chat box. Mm -hmm. right. Done. Okay. So. Below it? Yes, come again. Below it. Below it. Okay, so we already draw, okay, we already draw a hibiscus plant, we already draw. After you draw, you need to label. What is label? We give the name of the body part, okay. Of the plant's body part, we give the name. First one, we have enter. Second one, we have flower, okay, flower. Okay, the third one, we have leaf here, leaf, right. The fourth one, we have stem. Okay, then the last one, the fifth one, we have root. Just now, teacher said you guys have to memorize four. But now, we are drawing about hibiscus plants. So, hibiscus plant, they have enter. So, we add one more. But the most important part for you to remember is the flower, leaf, stem, and root. Ah, you need to know which one is the flower, which one is the leaf, which one is the stem. And which one is the root? If you're done drawing, okay, labeling, you can color. Right at beside the flower curve. Yes, uh, uh, you need to label, okay? Label uh, beside the flower. Label the flower beside the flower. Leaf beside the leaf. Uh, stem beside the stem. Root beside the root. Yes. Yes. Yes, who called teacher just now? Do you have anything to ask teacher? If you have any problem, you can have time. Okay, and the teacher color with yellow for the flower. I want to color with red. Okay, you can color your drawing. If you're done labeling, uh, make sure you label first. Before you color, make sure you label first. Ah, so that when you look at your book, you will know, oh, I have learned this one with teacher Diha. So I already labeled the flower. 
the leaf, the stem of this plant. Okay. So you can color your flower if you already done labeling. Make sure you label first before you color. Okay. Oh, teacher don't have brown here. If you have brown, you can color the stem with brown, okay? This one, teacher don't have brown in here. For the leaf, I will choose green. Right, you can color your drawing in your tatan book. Okay, so make sure you label all part of your plant. Okay, the enter, the flower here, the leaf, okay, the stem as well, and also the root. Uh, root is usually inside the soil, okay? Teacher don't have brown for root, so I'll use this color. Okay, for the root, you can use brown, same like uh, the color of the stem just now, okay? All right, there you go. Are you guys okay? Do you need any help? You can tell teacher if you have any problem, okay? If you have any problem, you can tell teacher. Okay. So, uh, teacher prepared the word wall gift, okay? I already uh, assigned the activity in the seesaw. Later, you can check, okay? Later, you can check. Then, as usual, you can play the game. Then, after you're done, you can take picture of your score, then upload in your seesaw, okay? Upload at the activity. Add response, then add the picture of your uh, game score. <laughs> okay, everyone. What did you? Yes. Yes. Happy the game. The game. Report tambah kuat. Teacher. Yes. Um, I don't have color. I don't have color. Can I? You don't have color, okay? I can't. Can uh -huh. I close the very noyet? Okay, I... wait. Uh, teacher will stop recording. Okay, I'll stop recording for a while. Wait, wait, wait. Later, teacher will. All right. Uh, for the games, uh, um, you can check the activity page. It's okay. Later, teacher will help you. I'll show you this one first. Okay, this one, the activity page. Okay. Um. Teacher already have one response. Iris. Wow, Iris already sent. <laughs> Iris sent the picture of her drawing. Well done, Iris. Thank you. Ah. Okay, in the Tatan book. Okay, this is your drawing to look like. Okay. Yes, who said on the microphone? Do you have anything to ask, teacher? Fatiha, Fatiha, you have microphone off. Do you have anything to ask teacher Fatiha? Okay, uh, so this one, okay, Iris sent her drawing. Thank you, Iris. Good job. She already labeled the uh, antler, the flower, the leaf, the stem, and also the root as well. Good job. Okay, so if you're already done with your drawing, you can click this link okay in seesaw click this link then you can play the game that teacher already prepared for you right okay if you're not done with the drawing teacher will show you the screen again don't worry wait i will stop presenting for a while okay stop recording okay 